Hello and welcome to Lord Fenton Gaming Plays Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I'm your expert assassin, Lord Fenton, and today's uh, guide we're doing a per season's image. That's right, we're going for a trophy slash achievement. So let's look at the map right now and see what quest we have to do. All right, real quick, I'm gonna zoom in and it's romancing the stone garden. That's the quest we're gonna do. So there'll be a cutscene ahead, and here we go. Curse upon us! Ah, oh, The gods are real. Help me, please! Silence, snake. What's going on? We will bring this evil creature to justice. They're lost in paranoia. They think I sacrificed my Ligia to the creature in the forest. Hold your fourth tongue. This walking curse is in league with a writhing thread. She just looks scared to me. Please, the creature took Ligia. If I die here, who will save her? I'll save Ligia, and kill any creature that tries to stop me. What are you saying? She will lead you to the petrified temple and your doom. What exactly is this creature? Evil, heartless, unknowable. We must end this girl before she leads a writhing thread right to us. The forest where the creature lives. Where is it? Beyond the petrified temple, north of here. A damned place, haunted by sade and filled with cursed stone. At its center lie ancient ruins from which few return. You mentioned the Ligia. She's... Beyond beauty, beyond grace. A daughter of Artemis. Brave, not like me. What dark prize did the writhing dread offer for her she soul? She lives, Mistios. I know it. This writhing dread has let Ligia live. We'll need to move now. Follow me. Careful. These people are driven by fear. The girl's coming with me. I'd suggest not standing in our way. She's whispered spells in your ear, Mistios. Citizens, we must save our city. And these interlopers must bleed. Hide in the temple. I'll deal with this. I am back from uh, combat, so what happened was these uh, rioters and the guards tried to kill this innocent woman. She's looking for a long lost love, so there'll be a cutscene ahead, so here we go. You're safe now. Safe? I don't want to be safe, Mistios. I want to look deep into Ligia's eyes just once more, even if it kills me. Love might be the end of us all, but it's a price worth paying. I polished Charon's drachmi long ago, Mistios. I'm ready. You know, I don't want to call you you forever. My name's Bris. Cassandra. Ligia's waiting for me, Cassandra. If I'd been captured, I'd never have to wait for her. Then let's not disappoint her. Where was she taken? From our sanctuary. The dread ruins in the Petrified Valley. And you're surprised she was taken by a creature? It's not safe here. We need to leave the city. I am back from that cutscene, so the next part of romancing the Stone Garden, we're following uh, Bryce. Yes, we're following Bryce right now, so let's see here. Okay, screw those horses. Let's go use them on my own ride since it's a thousand times better, of course. I'm going to be honest with you, this quest was fun. Now, the uh, length was actually in the middle, and the Medusa fight itself was not bad at all. Well, you have to use more tactics, of course. More on that later on. Still, we're going to follow Bryce over to this location. Once we uh, do that, then this quest shall be uh, completed and uh, finished so we uh, get in time for the next quest. All right, so we have to get off the horses and go into the Dread Ruins now. Once Bryce reaches a certain point and we, we reach there too, then the quest is now officially complete. Next one is Love's Long uh, Shadow. That's the next quest in the step. 
So far so good. That's not bad at all. It's not like the Minotaur one which you have to do a lot of work. And you got to do more work than the Cyclops one, so it kind of balances it out, of course. Alright, before we uh, go talk to uh, Bryce, we're going to loot these uh, Dread Runes up. I don't need money, but still, I just like to get some uh, quick cash, of course. You may never know which one you're going to need it and such, so let's uh, get to that right now. And inside this box is eye patch. So now let's go uh, speak with Bryce. There will be a cutscene ahead, so I'm going to let that roll, and now uh, here we go on that. This place is ours, Ligia's and mine. A forbidden place for forbidden love. Not much of a love nest. I've seen more romantic funerals. I found scraps of her clothes leading to the writhing dreads lair. Please, we need to hurry. Time to find Ligia. You lead the way. Well, we have to follow Bryce some more. That's the good news. Bad news is we're falling her into much more uh, dangerous ruins. Or I should say ruins that looks like uh, absolute crapola. Because something bad happened, of course, which isn't our fault, of course. It's uh, somebody else who did it, of course. That's another time, my theory. And we're now in the uh, Petrify uh, Temple area. Yeah, we're coming up on Medusa's lair. When the word petrified is there, that means something like stone or something. Yeah, you'll see that. And also in a bit, you see, oh yeah, those stone statues. Oh look, it's an extra from uh, the uh, 1984 Clash of the Titans. Yeah, those same uh, bastards got turned to stone. Medusa must have put him outside and went back in her lair real quick, of course. Alright, so we're getting information about these statues being lifelike, so we should be real cautious. So it's either A, a Gorgon bull that turned into stone, B, a basilisk with his eyesight, if he uh, stares at you, he turns you into stone, too, uh, C, a Medusa, or D, a wizard with uh, flesh to stone. Alright, let's get serious about this quest right about now instead of Dungeon and Dragon references, of course. Alright, back on point again. We're gonna follow Bryce some more. Now she's bowling towards Medusa's lair. So there'll be a cutscene ahead, and uh, here we go on that. need to get inside, but I see no openings, and the walls are too smooth to climb. She shouldn't be in there. She should be in my arms. Her breath, her smell. Every night we'd meet at the dread ruins. I was late, just once. I wanted to find her a rose, something as perfect as she is. This is my fault. If I'd gotten there in time, Then you'd both be trapped inside. Together? You are searching for a rose. A gift. Never regret an act of kindness, Breeze. Thank you. What do you know about this place? Ligia is a daughter of Artemis. Her people trained here long ago. A legend tells of an ancient artifact they recovered in a pit full of snakes. She believed they still had it, hidden in their village on Chios. I'll find it. There's also a mercenary, a man who claims he killed the creature. Impossible! But many believe him. He might know something. You said Ligia knew how to get into the lair. Where exactly is the key? The daughters of Artemis hide their most prized possessions in a cave in their village. It's protected by wild beasts and fierce warriors. The key is shaped like a disc. If they have it, it will be there. This mercenary, 
the slayer of the writhing dread. Where can I find him? He waits in a temple atop the hill in ancient peril. Champions from all over seek to challenge him to build their reputations, but there is no way he killed the creature. If he did, how was Ligia taken? Did you see the creature yourself? No, but only the writhing dread would be strong enough to take Ligia. She's too fierce. And too stubborn. I'll find a way inside, and then I'll kill this creature. And I'll find Ligia the Rose I should have given her that night. Someone, I tell you, in another time will remember us. The poet Sappho. Our favorite. Please, Cassandra, hurry. The region of the ancient pearl. I am back. Look like Love's Long Shower has been officially uh, complete. Put that on the uh, checklist. Now there are multiple quests. Hard to Archimedes, I am not going to do right away since there's another uh, multiple quest that's much, much more closer. So I'm going to skip ahead on that right about now. Well, look like I skipped ahead and it's heavy is the spears to quest. We have to find and talk with the uh, mercenary about the spear. Well, I don't know how good the spear is. I have a minotaur axe, which is a thousand times better. Now, those of you at home who do not have that at all, well, I have a previous video guide where you could get that axe and uh, profit, as I always say. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to look for this uh, mercenary and try to find him, of course. Alright, I am on the right track. I marked the uh, sink point. That's where the mercenary is. And I'm going to use my uh, eagle to uh, scout things out, of course. And let's see here. Where is he at? Where is he at? So I'm in explore mode. There he is right there on the temple on the hill. So there's going to be a uh, cutscene ahead. We're going to speak with the uh, mercenary. So what I'm going to do is when I uh, get very close by, I'm going to let that happen. So here we go on the uh, cutscene, of course. Excuse me? We're born into darkness and rise up to the greatest peaks before descending into darkness once more. A warrior and a sophist. This is a first. It is not philosophy. It's truth. Learn through violence, fate, and seeing evil. True evil. You're talking about the writhing dread? The creature. When it ambushed us outside, we thought only of survival. My spear allowed me to stay out of its gaze. I was lucky. My friends weren't. Tell me how you were able to defeat the creature. It all happened so fast. We had a plan to break into the temple and corner it. But it ambushed us before we got inside. There was no time for strategy after that. Why go after the creature in the first place? We were hired to steal an ancient item from within its lair by masked soldiers. Tell me about the item they wanted you to steal. Truth is, I don't even think they knew exactly what it is. After I killed the creature, I went to search the lair, but it was sealed. Give me that spear. We are warriors. To let it go without a fight would be to dishonor my fallen friends. You're no match for us, Lacronians! Fuck! I'm burning! Fuck! Help me! Nothing special about this spear. Well, put that in the completion list. Heavy is the spear of the third quest for uh, 
Percy's image is now uh, done so we're gonna skip ahead to the next quest we decided not to do right away so here we go well we have skipped ahead for hard to Artemides we have to reach the Huntress Villas in this area right here we're uh, 200 meters away which is a uh, pretty good now real quick we have to scout around for three items to get we could do anything like sneak, stealth, whatever, of course. So what we're gonna do is uh first of all, I think I'm gonna change this to uh night because it's gonna be much much better for me to uh sneak around since my Swiss Army Firebrand knife build, of course, does require night for that extra damage in case I get in uh in a move to a stealth kill. So we're gonna scout those out right now. We found the first one, the second one is, let's see here, come on Icarus, do it, do it, do it, do it, no it's a little bit far away, come on, get close, get close, you uh, sneaky like bird, okay, that is number two, and the third one should be coming up sooner or later, let's see here, yep, there's the third one, right, let's see here, I have to be a little bit more careful, very careful, there we go. Alright, all I'm going to do is I'm going to let the uh, action go on since it's going to be a lot of sneaking around, stealthing and such, so here we go. He's not here. Must be in another cave.
I'll keep looking. Well, I am back. We have two or three pieces that we need. And now we have the last one, the Gorgon disc. That's right. Um, Heart to Artemis is now officially in the completion book for Percy's image. So the next step naturally is to uh, 
get to uh, Medusa's lair, at least lead the door to try this key out, called the key to happiness, of course. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip ahead and return to uh, Bryce and see what's up with that, of course. I am back, and we have key to happiness, which is number five for Perseus's image. So this next one's easy. I'm going to let the cutscene go on, and we'll speak to Bryce right now. The mercenary knew nothing. He never made it inside the lair. Then it was a waste of time. Ligia waits and we've done nothing to help her. Not exactly. The mercenary carried this spear, which he claims killed the writhing dread. No, no, the creature took Ligia. It can't be dead. It waits in its lair even now. Then there may be a piece of this puzzle we don't yet understand. Have you found a way inside the lair? Ligia's story was true. The daughters of Artemis were protecting this... disc... keep... this... I have what opens the lair. And you didn't hurt any of the daughters when you took it? They didn't hear me or my blades, but they felt them, Brice. Why? Why would you? This disc is a prized possession. If I hadn't killed them, I never would have made it out alive, and Ligia would be lost. I... I suppose you did what you had to. Ligia's worth any price. I am back, so the next step is going to open this door up, of course, and we're going to follow Bryce inside the lair. So we'll see how things go, of course. So we have to go after Bryce because she went a little bit crazy looking for a long-lost love. So I'm going to let this uh, cutscene go on and explain more when we see get inside the lair, of course. Brice, wait! Ligia! Ligia! Malaka. While we follow Bryce uh, in this layer, here's the tactics for Medusa. Now when she shoots her uh, lasers out of her eyes, she'll turn you to stone or try to. Hide behind the pillars or lie in sight her, otherwise it'd probably be a game over. Second, when she shields up, get rid of those uh, stone guardians so her shield gets free. Now other things is, is she'll uh, do is uh, AoE attack on the ground. When she does that, move away ASAP. If you don't, you're going to get hurt. That's worse if you get turned into stone or partially into stone, you'll take extra damage most likely, which is bad. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let this uh, cutscene go on and uh, here we go on that.
gross. I hate snakes. Someone, I tell you, in another time, will remember us. I am back. That was a tragedy that just happened, and we uh, won the fight. Now you should get the. Uh First, these image trophy slash achievement, of course, and a nice Medusa figurehead. Well, that is it for today's video. This is Lord Fett signing off. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Later's all.